Fyodor Dostoevsky quotes. Above all, don't lie to yourself. The man who lies to himself and listens to his own lie comes to a point that he cannot distinguish the truth within him or around him, and so loses all respect for himself and for others. And having no respect he ceases to love. Pain and suffering are always inevitable for a large intelligence and a deep heart. But to fall in love does not mean to love. One can fall in love and still hate. Sorrow compressed my heart, and I felt I would die. And then, well, then I woke up. I will not and cannot believe that evil is the normal condition of mankind. There is only one thing that I dread. Not to be worthy of my sufferings. To go wrong in one's own way is better than to go right in someone else's. What is hell? I maintain that it is the suffering of being unable to love. Man only likes to count his troubles. He doesn't calculate his happiness. Talking nonsense is the sole privilege mankind possesses over the other organisms. It's by talking nonsense that one gets to the truth. I talk nonsense. Therefore I'm human. The soul is healed by being with children. People speak sometimes about the bestial cruelty of man. But that is terribly unjust and offensive to beasts. No animal could ever be so cruel as a man. So artfully. So artistically cruel. We sometimes encounter people. Even perfect strangers. Who begin to interest us at first sight. Somehow suddenly, all at once, before a word has been spoken. I love mankind, he said, but I find to my amazement that the more I love mankind as a whole, the less I love man in particular. It takes something more than intelligence to act intelligently. But how could you live and have no story to tell? The mystery of human existence lies not in just staying alive but in finding something to live for. Taking a new step, uttering a new word, is what people fear most. Much unhappiness has come into the world because of bewilderment and things left unsaid. Right or wrong, it's very pleasant to break something from time to time. Nothing in this world is harder than speaking the truth. Nothing easier than flattery. The world says, you have needs satisfy them. You have as much right as the rich and the mighty. Don't hesitate to satisfy your needs. Indeed, expand your needs and demand more. This is the worldly doctrine of today. And they believe that this is freedom. The result for the rich is isolation and suicide. For the poor, envy and murder. To love someone means to see them as God intended them. Man is a mystery. It needs to be unraveled. And if you spend your whole life unraveling it, don't say that you've wasted time. I am studying that mystery because I want to be a human being. I swear to you gentlemen, that to be overly conscious is a sickness. A real, thorough sickness. The awful thing is that beauty is mysterious as well as terrible. God and the devil are fighting there and the battlefield is the heart of man. You can be sincere and still be stupid. If you wish to glimpse inside a human soul and get to know a man. Don't bother analyzing his ways of being silent. Of talking. Of weeping. Of seeing how much he is moved by noble ideas. You will get better results if you just watch him laugh. If he laughs well. He's a good man. It is not the brains that matter most, but that which guides them. The character, the heart, generous qualities, progressive ideas. Don't let us forget that the causes of human actions are usually immeasurably more complex and varied than our subsequent explanations of them. I think the devil doesn't exist, but man has created him. He has created him in his own image and likeness. Pain and suffering are always inevitable for a large intelligence and a deep heart. It is better to be unhappy and know the worst, than to be happy in a fool's paradise. If you want to be respected by others, 
the great thing is to respect yourself. Only by that, only by self-respect will you compel others to respect you. To love is to suffer and there can be no love otherwise. Sarcasm. The last refuge of modest and chaste souled people when the privacy of their soul is coarsely and intrusively invaded. Besides, nowadays, almost all capable people are terribly afraid of being ridiculous and are miserable because of it. Nothing is easier than to denounce the evildoer. Nothing is more difficult than to understand him. The more stupid one is, the closer one is to reality. The more stupid one is, the clearer one is. Stupidity is brief and artless. While intelligence squirms and hides itself, intelligence is unprincipled. But stupidity is honest and straightforward. The cleverest of all, in my opinion, is the man who calls himself a fool at least once a month. When reason fails, the devil helps. If you want to overcome the whole world, overcome yourself. I could not become anything. Neither good nor bad. Neither a scoundrel nor an honest man. Neither a hero nor an insect. And now I am eking out my days in my corner, taunting myself with the bitter and entirely useless consolation that an intelligent man cannot seriously become anything. That only a fool can become something. I am a dreamer. I know so little of real life that I just can't help reliving such moments as these in my dreams. For such moments are something I have very rarely experienced. I am going to dream about you the whole night, the whole week, the whole year. The greatest happiness is to know the source of unhappiness. A hundred suspicions don't make a proof. The degree of civilization in a society can be judged by entering its prisons. Grown-up people do not know that a child can give exceedingly good advice even in the most difficult case. The fear of appearances is the first symptom of impotence. Power is given only to him who dares to stoop and take it. One must have the courage to dare. A fool with a heart and no sense is just as unhappy as a fool with sense and no heart. Love all God's creation, both the whole and every grain of sand. Love every leaf, every ray of light. Love the animals. Love the plants. Love each separate thing. If thou love each thing thou wilt perceive the mystery of God in all. And when once thou perceive this, Thou wilt thenceforward grow every day to a fuller understanding of it. Until thou come at last to love the whole world with a love that will then be all-embracing and universal. Without God all things are permitted. Existentialism isn't so atheistic that it wears itself out showing that God doesn't exist. Rather, it declares that even if God did exist, that would change nothing. Be not forgetful of prayer. Every time you pray, if your prayer is sincere, there will be new feeling and new meaning in it, which will give you fresh courage. And you will understand that prayer is an education. Lying to ourselves is more deeply ingrained than lying to others. Man has it all in his hands. And it all slips through his fingers from sheer cowardice. One can fall in love and still hate. Love children especially, for they too are sinless like the angels. They live to soften and purify our hearts and, as it were, to guide us. Nothing has ever been more insupportable for a man and a human society than freedom. Nature doesn't ask your permission. It doesn't care about your wishes, or whether you like its laws or not. You're obliged to accept it as it is and consequently all its results as well. Intelligence alone is not nearly enough when it comes to acting wisely. To be in love is not the same as loving. You can be in love with a woman and still hate her. The man who is happy is fulfilling the purpose of existence. Dreams seem to be spurred on not by reason but by desire. Not by the head but by the heart. 
and yet what complicated tricks my reason has played sometimes in dreams. May you be forever blessed for that moment of bliss and happiness which you gave to another lonely and grateful heart. Such a moment sufficient for the whole of one's life. Lack of originality. Everywhere. All over the world. From time immemorial has always been considered the foremost quality and the recommendation of the active, efficient and practical man. She looked much younger than her age. Indeed, which is almost always the case with women who retain serenity of spirit, sensitiveness and pure sincere warmth of heart to old age. Man, so long as he remains free, has no more constant and agonizing anxiety than find as quickly as possible someone to worship. Power is given only to those who dare to lower themselves and pick it up. Only one thing matters. One thing. To be able to dare. There are things which a man is afraid to tell even to himself. And every decent man has a number of such things stored away in his mind. Quote, quote, dot, dot, dot. Active love is a harsh and fearful thing compared with the love in dreams. Love in dreams thirsts for immediate action, quickly performed, and with everyone watching. Indeed, it will go as far as the giving even of one's life. Provided it does not take long but is soon over, as on stage, and everyone is looking on and praising whereas active love is labor and persistence, and for some people, perhaps, a whole science, by interpreting freedom as the propagation and immediate gratification of needs, people distort their own nature, for they engender in themselves a multitude of pointless and foolish desires, habits, and incongruous stratagems, their lives are motivated only by mutual envy sensuality, and ostentation. Faith does not, in the realist, spring from the miracle but the miracle from the faith. I gave up caring about anything, and all the problems disappeared.